Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Blaze Killer and today we are back with another video and today's video is going to be another tier list video. Today's tier list video is going to be a candy bar tier list video. I was thinking to myself, I was asking myself, what other tier list uh, potentials, options, opportunities are there in this game? I feel like I've exhausted them. Um, but this came to mind and we have 48 different candy bars to rank so we'll go, we'll be going uh, pretty quickly through all of these but if you do have any other suggestions for tier list videos please let me know in the comments below. If you want to play this for yourself go to tiermaker.com and search this up in the search bar and uh, you can play this. I made this as you can see here and uh, let's just go here to presentation mode let's start by ranking all of these candies now these candies will be ranked uh, based on the criteria of creativity and just overall um i don't know how, how it sounds how it looks how it appears and how i guess my personal reaction and uh, what my personal reaction is to it these candy bars if you don't know are toys are, are plays are plays on on real candy bars in in, in real life so um as you can see uh, I, you can't fully see all these candy bars, so I will be accompanying each one of these with a picture on the screen of the full-size version of these candy bars. I, I couldn't get them to fit, unfortunately, on here, as well as accompanying these with the real-life counterpart, if that makes sense. So you'll see what I mean when we, uh, when we get started, but we have, again, 48 different candy bars and from five different um, candy bags, starting with the bag of candy. Um, we will be jumping in with Lumbar, which is a play on the Lunch Bar um, candy bar in real life. This is a, I mean, even if this wasn't a play on words here, or a play on, on, on a real candy bar, it's, it's definitely a play on words, right? You have Lumber, Lumbar. I actually do like this. I think it's very creative. Um, and if it wasn't Lunch Bar, I, I, I didn't, didn't even know that. I, I don't know, you know, I would, I would still rank it pretty high, right? So let's go to the next one, which is this Walnut Roll. I asked myself, is this like Tootsie Roll? Turns out it's a salted nut roll is what this was going off of here. I like it. It's um, walnut roll, salted nut roll. I, it's all right. I'm going to give it C tier for now. And again, I'll, I'll probably adjust these later. Next one is Hoover's. Um, this one is a play on Hershey's. I don't personally think it's super creative. I think it's just like, hey, we have an H. You know, Hoover is the boat guy. I'm going to put it D tier. I don't think it's super creative. Same thing with Sinister here. It's a play on, obviously, Sinister wood, but really Snickers in real life. I don't think it's super creative. I'm going to go three developers. Is it play on, um, um, what is it? The three musketeers, right? Um, it's not super creative. It's I think it's a little bit more creative than the previous one, but I'm going to have to put that in C, or C tier as a result. Um, now the last one of the bag of candy, besides this unique one we'll talk about in a second, is Chop. This one is a play on Crunch. I don't think it's super creative. I mean, it has that alliteration, the Crunch, the Chop, at least the, the onomatopoeia, whatever whatever it is. You yeah, have that sound of, of crunching, of chopping something. I think it's a little bit more creative than these two. I'm going to have to move these down probably and then move these probably down because you'll see pretty soon that we're going to run into some more creative ones that I'm going to rank higher. And these ones and we have the special one now i want to actually probably save these for last these are special candy bars if you don't know they're rare um, these plain colored ones they're rare versions of, of uh, from each of these bags of candy and um they do give you particle effects when you consume them but they're rare i'll talk about them in a second and i'll, I'll think of some ways to rank them in the meantime uh, jumping to the purple bag of candy we start off with a hundred money which is a play on a hundred ma uh um, 100 grand which is a, a a candy bar i like this i mean money grand right i think it actually works out pretty nicely i'm gonna give it a b tier kip king is a play on kit kat um i don't personally understand um this one i mean um it says the bar reference is like default to his new unnamed project with kit being the currency for the game um so i understand it briefly like it has to do with him a little bit defaultio specifically but i'm gonna you know i made a mistake here i'm gonna move this up Kip King, I don't like this one. I don't like this one. I mean, it's not creative, at least too creative. I'm gonna put it right here. Okay, next one is Milky Maze, which is play a play on Milky Way. The maze obviously referring to the maze in the game. I think it's pretty creative. Milky Way, Milky Maze, I think has that kind of rhyming scheme a little bit. I'm gonna have to put it in beats here. Next is um, TNT, which is um, a play on M&Ms. It's not a candy bar, of course, but it's still a candy nonetheless. And M&M TNT, I, I, it's not super creative, and I'm not sure I like it too much. I'm gonna have to, and I'll, I'll put it in B tier. I'll keep it in B tier. I think that's fair. Birds is a play on nerds. Um, this is 
uh, a big part of the game really. We have uh, two red eagles can be found uh, beside the logo of this, of this, as you can see on the screen. Hopefully, I put it on the screen earlier, and it has to do with the the quest for the Rookery Act, which is, which says like follow the eagle, right? So it's a big part of this game. Birds, nerds, and I think because it, it just sounds cool and it rhymes, and it has to do with the game, it's going to get a pretty high spot up here. Um, I'll leave it there and I'll adjust them as necessary. Next is um, Dope, uh, sorry, not Dope, <laughs> Dupe Patch Kids. This is a play on Sour Patch Kids and I love this because it has to do with like a reference to duplication in this game and patch, right? A perfect word for that, like, you know, a duplication glitch being patched, for example. I'm gonna have to put it in S here. I think it's super creative. I really like that one. Let's go to uh, Plots. This one is a play on Dots, I believe. Um, and I think it's also really creative. I, I like the, um, obviously that it rhymes, of course, but the plots is a huge part of the game as well because, you, you know, we have uh, plots that you load onto, right? Scoop Heads, I didn't initially understand this one. This is moving on to the 2021 um, candy, that is the green bag of candy. We started with the 2018, we skipped a year to 2020, now we're in 2021. And Scoop Head is a play on Lemon Heads. I had to look that one up because I didn't fully, I didn't understand the reference there. But scoop heads, lemon heads. Um, I actually like this. The scoop head is an actual thing in the game, and um, I think it's pretty darn creative. I'm gonna have to put that in B tier. Boulders is a play on whoppers, and I don't, you know, I don't like this one too much. I think it's not as creative as the previous ones, but not as bad as these ones. Next one is the burger protein bar. It's a reference to burger cola, and. Um, the burger cola based protein bar. And I believe the burger cola is from the gift of unhealthy diet. So we actually have this in the game um, as well. And yeah, so uh, what's interesting to note about a lot of these, I don't really have time to mention it, but on, on the sides of a lot of these bars, there's some like funny, um, just quotes, I guess, from whoever made these bars. Like for this one says like made with excess grease. Some of these on the sides of the bars have to do with different features in the game. Um, I'll, I'll try to give you a, 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 an idea or an example of one when I get to it, but I don't have I don't have time to do that for all of them. Burger protein bar. I don't like this too much. I think it's pretty lame. I'm not gonna lie. I'm sorry for those of you who do like that. I mean, this F tier has to get filled some somehow, right? <laughs> okay, let's go to Mr. Wood Bar. I do like this one a lot because it is a play on Mr. Good Bar. It's another Hershey-owned um, candy bar, but it rhymes. Wood Bar, Good Bar. I'm gonna have to put that in A tier. Ah man, Josh. This one, I was like, what is this referring to? I could see the font is like a, a Almond Joy font, and that's exactly what it is. I mean, think about it. If you say it slowly, Almond Joy, Almond ah Josh, and if you don't know, Josh is the creator of the game. He's Defaultio. That's his name in real life, Josh. Um, I think it, it's really creative. I, I think I do like this one. Probably not A tier, but probably B tier for sure. Axe Heads is, I thought it was Warheads initially for, uh, for some reason, but it's Airheads. I'm not sure why I thought Warheads, but it's Airheads. And it works really well because axe heads is an actual thing of actual part of the axe, right? I'm gonna have to put that in B tier and we'll adjust those as necessary later. Twig, it's, it's really funny. I mean, it's a play on Twix, obviously, and we have different things in, you know, different twigs as part of the trees in this game, right? So that's, um, it's, it's, it's not as creative as these ones, I would say, but I do like it. Um, yeah, so that, that concludes the green bag of candy. Let's go to the blue bag of candy, which is the 2022 bag of candy. These, are, these were all released in the the um, Halloween event, I believe. So let's go to Snow Cone here. Um, the Snow Cone, wait, I don't even know if this one is, yeah, it is, it's part of this candy bar. Okay, yeah, the Snow Cones are uh, a reference to um, uh, Snow Caps. Snow Caps is the candy bar, sorry about that. Wait, I'm trying to, Look at my notes here. But yeah, snow caps is the candy bar in real life. Snow cones, snow caps, uh, I don't know if I like it. I, I think it's not as creative as the previous ones. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have to put that down here. Let's go to uh, Butter Flinger is the next one here, instead of Butter Finger, right? And uh, this refers to being able to fling things around with uh, in the game, I believe. I do like this one. I think it deserves a C tier. It's a solid one, not too special though. Let's go to Junior Blueprints, I think is the next one we go from here. This is a play on Junior Mints, and um, I think it's good. I think it's creative. I think it's actually more creative than the previous ones. I do like the way it sounds, Junior Blueprints, Junior Mints. It's super funny because Blueprints just happens to, to rhyme with mints in such a, a funny way that this could actually work out in the end. Um, let's go to Give 5. This is, it's, it's not as creative as the previous ones. It, it's a reference to Take 5. The 
excuse me, candy bar. Um, but yeah, um, what's interesting, I'll d just give you another reference here. Uh, around the front of the bar can be seen a Roblox message that reads, why no money, give money, give $5, please, <laughs> please donate. <laughs> so it's just kind of a, to give you guys an example of like some text that's written on the side. Some are funny, some are like references to the game, some are like short little Easter egg, you know, little Easter eggs, nothing too important to be seen there. Uh, the give five, I'm gonna have to give it a, mm, I'm gonna have to give it a C tier. The next is going to be red signs. We have a lot of them for this uh, 2022 and 2023 um, to go through here. So just stick with me. We're gonna, you know, get through this together. <laughs> uh, red signs is a play obviously on red vines. I like this one. It's decent. There aren't really red red signs in the game, so it doesn't work out as well. Um, but I'm gonna have to give it. I'll give it C tier. It's it's it's, it's kind of mid. Um, all right, Shabby Taffy is a play on Laffy Taffy, and it refers to the Shabby Sawmill, if you weren't already aware. Um, it has in the front no modded wood, <laughs> Re referencing the recent uh, mod patches to the, you know, making modded wood in the sawmills. Um, with that said, I do like it. Shabby, it has, you know, refers to the Shabby Sawmill. I think it is more creative than the previous ones. I'm gonna have to give it a C tier as a result, or a B tier, sorry. Uh, Twizzlers, Twizzlers, it's a similar thing happening here with Twig. You know, Twig's Twig. I do think it's a, mm, Twigglers. Yeah, I'm gonna have to put it in the same tier as the Twig. I think it's only fair. I don't think I should put it higher than that. Um, next one is going to be the Original Tree. It's a play on Original Sprees. Uh, sp yeah. yeah, yeah, the, the Original Spree Candy. I had to look that one up as well because I wasn't sure. Um, original tree, original spree tree obviously works. I think it's mid. Um, let's go with cars. This is another mid one, I think. It's a play on Mars. Uh, nothing much more needs to be said about that. Jenny's is a uh, reference to Reese's, if you can kind of see. It says Reese's, or sorry, Jenny's peanut butter trucks. So that's kind of funny, right? Um, that's pretty clear what it is, what it's referring to. Um, I don't really know what to rank this as. It's it's not super creative. Um, uh, Jenny's, Jenny's, it's, it's it's another mid one. I think we, we're gonna have a lot of mid ones in here, which is fine. Uh, Hoover's is the next one. The Hoover's Tropics and Trees, which is a reference to uh, the Hershey bar, um, cookies and cream variant of the Hershey bar. And I think that it's another mid one, I think, right? All right, going to the 2023, the uh, golden bag of candy, we have uh, for the first one, Built Stuff. Now, this Built Stuff is a reference to the Built Protein Bar. I wasn't really, I didn't realize that Built, that was actually a thing to begin with. Built Stuff, Built Protein Bar. You guys can see where I'm doing with this. I don't think it's super creative. I think it even deserves to go down there. Caracello here is a reference to um, Caramello, and um, it's it's pretty good. Like you're selling a car. I think it's relatively creative. I think it's more creative than the previous ones. If you if you had to ask me, so it's gonna go to B tier. Let's go to Torque. Torque is actually a really fun one because uh, the original one's called York, but I think it's something that you really wouldn't think of. You wouldn't think of like, hey, what rhymes with what York with uh, York, right? Um, but torque does, and torque, if you don't know, is like a rotational force that has to do with cars. So you see a car, I think it's the front here, or maybe there's a wheel, I think it's a wheel up here. It has to do with like a rotating force, so like the wheel. Um, torque, York, it's creative, so I think it, has to, it can't be mid, it has to be at least B tier in my, in my eyes. Um, let's see here. Uh, let's go to alts. Alts is the next one. This is not a candy bar, what it's referring to. It's Altoids, is like a mint, right? Alts, I'm not really sure um, what else is going on here. I think it's, yeah, I'm not really um, sure. Uh, on the on the front, or at least on the sides, it says, the original cheaters, curiously strong crooks, 100% different accounts. Uh, I guess it's referring to alt accounts. That makes sense. I actually do like that. Because it, it says like cheaters right on the side, so it's actually super creative. Hmm. I think I'm gonna have to, to move that up to alt, like an alt account. That's actually really cool. I do like that. I, yeah. It's sorry. I, it took me a second to actually figure out what that meant. Um, next one is high chop. 
This one has to do with uh, high chews, and it's, you have zombie wood here on the side, and it's not super creative. It's gonna have to be mid, uh, mid you know, B, uh, sorry, C tier. Let's go to dupe mounds. This one's actually super creative. I like this one. The uh, candy bar it's referring to is mounds, just mounds as it is. But this one added dupe mounds to it because like, <laughs> dupe, you know, you're duplicating. On the side of this candy bar reads duped and cheated. <laughs> so it really refers to what looks like even just like just duplicated candy bars or whatever that is in the background. I like this. I think it's, uh, I think it's, um, it's at least, I'm gonna have to give it, I'll give it A tier, I might move it, move it down to B tier later. Next one is going to be Save Fails, and this one is a reference to Cowtails, the candy. And I had to look that one up because I didn't originally uh, understand that. But I like this one a lot because, like, you know when your save fails, uh, I think it's a um, pretty common occurrence for all of us. I'm going to have to put that in B tier as a result. Um, I also had to look up this next one, which is um, Rough... Roads. It's a reference to the Rocky Road bar. I've never actually heard of that, but I, I um, had to look that one up. I don't think it's super creative. I think it is mid, if not probably less than mid. I'm gonna have to keep it D tier. Next one is Pop Boulders, which is a reference to Pop Rocks, the Pop Rocks candy. Um, I think it works out perfectly because we have rocks, we have boulders. It has to go in B tier at least. Next one is going to be May Day, which is a reference, I believe, to like Hoover and the boat. I just like the boats in general and more specifically the ferry. Um, May Day is, you know, obviously something you say when you're going down, right? Uh, he says uh, it, and it's a reference to payday if I didn't already say that. Um, I don't know if I like this. I think it's kind of mid. It's, it's not as bad as Kip King. Okay, I'll leave it there. I'm sorry. I'm like, I'm throwing shade on Kip King. Let's go on Jenny's. Uh, Jenny's, this is the same one as this one pretty much, but it is a, um, the white variant. So peanut butter trucks for the same reason. I put it in C tier. I'm going to put that one in C tier. And a similar thing with this one, TNT. This is a reference to the, um, it says TNT choppy cherry, by the way, on the actual candy bar. It's a reference to the, co the crunchy cookie M&M variant. So wherever my TNT one is here, I'll put that one up in there as well. I feel, yeah, okay, that's fair. Okay, and now we're left with these other candy bars. We have three pinks, one blue, and one, um, one yellow here. We have the 2018, 20, 21, 22, and 23. Um, these come from all of those different candy bars. Um, how do I rank this? I think this is also uh, an interesting thing to note. This came out of the, the golden candy uh, bag of candy, the blue bag of candy, and then the rest of them were green, purple, and pink, respectively. So they kind of match up. These two don't really match up. I guess this is kind of purplish. This is not green, though. You figured, you figured it'd be like green or something. Now, how do I rank these? They're not really candy bars. I can't really judge them based on creativity. I think it is only fair that I leave them where they are here because they're not candy bars in themselves. They just give you particle effects. Um, but yeah, give me a second. I'll cut the video and I'm gonna rearrange some things in each you know different category. Um, having everything on the left side be the best possible and everything um, towards this right side you know, getting worse as we go. I'm gonna cut the video, rearrange this and come back and uh, let me know what you guys think about my finished product. All right, that's my finished product. I actually moved um, Junior Blueprints up to S tier. I think it's just, it sounds great. Uh, the Blueprints, it's a funny, um, funny, you know, rhyming scheme there. Um, and I changed things around a little bit. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of this final, um, I guess my final product. And um, let me know if you agree with me, where you disagree with me, where you agree with, agree with me. And also leave in the comments any more tier list ideas that you guys can think of. And I'll try to, with your help, make those videos a reality. Without further ado, hope you guys did enjoy this video. Hope you did learn some new things about these candy bars. And I hopefully introduce you to some candy bars. Let me know if you were to rank these bars, where would they go? Uh, without further ado, though, thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and um, turn on the bell for me so that you'll be notified whenever I do upload a new video. And speaking of new video, next week is, is uh, going to be the Thanksgiving video. So stay tuned for that. Hop on for Thanksgiving. Remember that this game has uh, a little Thanksgiving event, not super big, but you know has a, a turkey, uh, some some form of a turkey, um, and probably some other items as well. So stay tuned for the, that video and hop on Lumber Tycoon for Thanksgiving or around Thanksgiving at least. So you guys can take part in that cool event. I will see you guys then. Peace out.